Um, hey guys, um, I know that we're wearing like the same clothes. I know. <laughs> we're just filming like three videos at once because like we just saw it and we kind of wanted just to say it right now, fresh in our minds. Yeah. So this uh, review is on the history of Trunks uh, TV special that they had. And um, I showed him it um, the other day. I love Trunks, my favorite drag ball character. Yeah, um, I got on Blu-ray the other day so I wanted to watch it. Um, Okay, so the story starts with, um, basically, it's basically the story, by the way, if you haven't seen the movie. Spoiler, don't. Spoilers, okay. Turn it off. Um, okay, so if you haven't, okay, so it starts, well, let's, it starts, the whole thing is basically, um, Future Trunks' past, like his past, and then, you know, like, you know, his past, if, um, Goku were to die, like, um, and he never got the medicine that he needed to, to beat the androids and all that. Um, so it shows how, what ha what would have happened. Um, Goku is dead, like, you know, he's dying, the heart attack. And then, you know, he died. And then, um, the androids come and defeat all the Z-Warriors, the Sea fighters The only people that survived was Trunks, which he was a baby. Of course, Bulma and Gohan and so and then it really cuts to 10 or no no 13 years later yeah and um shows Trunks that's like a teenager like he's like 13 and you see um him basically basically you see how um everything progressed without any of them alive and how the the androids continue to destroy all the cities and stuff, but it's like very slowly, little by little. It like it shows that Gohan actually um, tried to stop them, or it kind of tried to at least slow them down from the destruction. Yeah. He would go um, try to fight them, but he would always escape, and he he wouldn't end up like dying or anything. He'd leave before ever getting killed or anything. He wouldn't save anyone. Um, but you know, it it just shows like Trunks getting all pissed off because the androids are just like. Like destroying everything, he's like I can't take this anymore, and um, um, shows him with Bulma, and he just he's like, you know, I want to see like what they're doing, and Bulma's like, you know, I don't want you to get killed, but he just leaves anyway, and he goes and he sees how all the destruction that the androids have done, and then um, he meets up with Gohan basically, and he he asks him like if he could train him because he's like tired of seeing everything like being destroyed, and he wants to help defeat like you know the androids who wants to try to defend everything his, his planet and so um gohan basically takes him under his wing gohan looks awesome anyway I know. and so he trains him and um you see him just training him and he's trying to turn super saiyan and all that but he can't and then it goes to um to the androids destroying stuff and you know, Gohan like hears about it and he goes to try to fight the androids. And like Trunk wants to go Trunks wants to go, but like he's like not ready, you know, get lazy kind of thing. Yeah. I mean you, um doesn't the show seem where like where they're both trying to fight? Yeah. They're, yeah. They're both fighting. No, but I mean it's after. Like what he does is he knocks out Trunks. No, I know that, but like beforehand then they try to fight him again. Yeah. Yeah, they tried to find him fight him together, right? Yeah. But he was slowing him down. Like with with Trunks being there, like it, it didn't it didn't let Gohan really concentrate very well to like to fight, you know. Um, so they almost got killed. They almost got killed. Yeah, they almost got killed. That's right. I forgot mm -hmm. this part. Almost got killed. Um, Gohan got his arm blown off. Um, he's on the ground, like all beat up, and um, and so is Trunks. And you see that he has like one sensu beam left and he's crawling on the floor. He's like, what would my father do? And he goes and gives it to Trunks. He's like, you know, eat it. And so Trunks, you know, gets back up and sees Gohan all beat up with all his arm and he takes him to Bulma. And, um, yeah, um, they, you know, um, take care of him. They help him get back up on his feet. <laughs> and... Then they were right out there. Then they went right back out to fight again the androids, and you know, um, Trunks wanted to go with him, and that's when, uh, you know, I didn't even see, and that's when um, Gohan 
was like, you know, I really can't um, let you go with me because, you know, you slow me down. I, I'm worried about, I, I don't want to be worried about you while I fight them and all that. And then Trump was like, please, please, I, like, I want to go. It's not like, I don't, you can't go there alone and you're injured. And so Gohan's like, okay, let's go. <laughs> I thought that was pretty funny, that part. Yeah. And he's like, okay, yeah. And then he like just knocks him out. Like, In the back of his neck. Yeah, and he gets knocked out. He's like, I'm sorry, I just couldn't let you go. So he just goes and he fights them and everything. So he's having this epic battle with androids. Trunks is still knocked out. And then by the time that Trunks gets back up, he wakes up, Gohan, he finds, he tries to look for Gohan. He's like, damn it, why'd you go without me? He finds him dead. Yeah. He's crying there, and he's all like, "Oh my God, no!" Mm. And so he's that was his incent his incentive to turn Super Saiyan, and um, he did it. And yeah, and then like as it progressed, like um, you hear Trunks went to go fight the androids um, directly after because he heard um, you know, on, like, the radio that they were actually near a city that's near where his mom, Bulma, lived. I don't know, but that's... Doesn't it, sh it shows the years later past. Yeah. It shows... And they were, like, nearing... It was, like, three years were. later or something. Three years later, and then it shows, you know, Trunks older, how he is, and, you know, the future Trunks looking. Um, and that's that's that part where he hears the radio. Yeah. And he's like, oh, I'm gonna... And Bulma's like, you need to take the time machine. Like, you know, why are you gonna... He's like, I want to get it done now. And he tries to do defeat them. Um, he, cut, he gets some like pretty good blows, yeah, like he does where like job, he knocks but... a shirt, but yeah, they're at the end like they kick sh the shit out of him. Yeah, so he's like, you know what? Yeah, like I have to go. I'm just gonna go to the um the past, and he that's where it just it shows you know how and she's like, oh here's a mess and give it to Goku, and that's where it cuts out. Like you know it just goes to the past with future Trunks where he comes in and all that. So it, it was, I really love that movie because it shows like the story it shows of more Future Trunks. Of, of Trunks, my bad. <laughs> of Future Trunks. And um, and how everything would have been if he never yeah, came. Back. Yeah. And how everything would have been a shit. <laughs> oh, so um, I, I love seeing that. That was like really cool. I, that's one of my favorite movies. Pardon is, is, is my, my favorite one though. Yeah, but the... History of Trunks is good at it. It's just really cool how they just explain the story. Very detailed, too. I was very surprised. I thought it was just going to be like very simple, but it was like very detailed. I was like, cool. Yeah. But I like I like future Gohan better than like the Gohan that that he actually becomes. <laughs> He's like a nerd and everything. He doesn't fight as much. Mm. Anyway, but I, lo I like the movie a lot. I love G2 Trunks. Okay, so I like the movie a lot. And... Um, definitely, I like the TV specials, I don't know, they always like them really good, I thought they were really good. So, the movie, definitely, you know, you have to watch it, obviously, probably a lot of you have watched it already, but it was just basically an uh, in-depth explanation of the movie, and it's, it's good, I like it. I've been watching it since I was freaking like, seven. <laughs> so, I love it. Okay. Um, until... My next video, guys. Peace. Uh -huh. Okay. Wait.